if you want to involve yourself into dropshipping, you will need some tools. Now, this was all before done by hand, right, by yourself. You can do the product research, you can check the websites, you can check the ad copies on Facebook, on TikTok. But nowadays, you got to use some tools. Now, you can use the free versions of it if you don't have some extra cash lying around. But the thing is, it all comes down to this. Whether you have time and dedication and whether you want to put the effort into doing these little things by yourself or you want to streamline the process with the help of tools such as Minia. But one thing is for sure, you don't need to buy any course. I know there's a lot of people out there that are just like, oh, hey, here's some basic information that you can already find online. Please give me 50 bucks for it. Don't fall for it. You don't need any kind of course. You don't need to pay any special lessons. You don't have to go to Udemy. You don't have to click the shady links down there in the description to buy a certain course. All the information that you need out there is already online. All right. Just Google for it. All the basic information is out there. Drop shipping, well, it's not going to make you a millionaire. There's a lot of people doing it, but you can still get a piece of that pie for yourself. So what is Minia and how can it help us? Well, as you can see, they say that it is all-in-one solution designed to help you launch your e-commerce, scale your sales, boost profits, blah, blah, blah. The good thing about this one is that they have free trial. And if I head over to the price section here, you can see that the starter plan is $49 per month. As I've told you, you don't have to pay it, but it is a good thing if you have some extra cash lying around. It's better for this than it is to buy a certain course. Now, I'm not affiliating for these people. You will not find any links down there, I promise. But what I like about this one is this. You can import your products directly to Shopify. You can find your manufacturers, which will give you these products, and you can discover these products that are already performing well on the market. So how to start with this one, head over to Minia website. You can just Google for it and then just click on free trial here. And already, even without making yourself an account, you can see some of these products, some of these copy ad copies that are online, right? Whether it's on TikTok, whether it's on Facebook, whether it's on Pinterest, as you can see, well, these are all performing well. Now, I've told you, especially when it comes to Pinterest, you don't need this type of tool if you plan to use Pinterest in order to make your sales, right? And it's simply because of this. Pinterest has this tool, which is already free. It's called Pinterest Trends. And you've surely heard about it before. It can give you the inspiration of what kind of products to search for based on these graphs. And as you can see, they can show you the growing trends. You can see the top monthly, top yearly trends, for example. So top yearly trends. As you can see, nails are always good on Pinterest, fashion, aesthetic, outfit. If people are searching for it, the products are going to sell. It's that simple. All you have to do is to be dedicated with it and to find that sweet spot and to make a lot of mistakes, of course. But what I do recommend is to hunt for seasons because if you just type in, let's say, Halloween, just like this, so Halloween, and if you just wait for these, well, this is all what people are searching for. So if I click on Halloween crafts, you will see that last year, of course, it's going to pop up. But as you can see, now is the right time to pop on this trend. Well, I don't know when are you going to watch this video, but there are many seasons. It's Christmas, Halloween, New Year's Eve, Easter, whole year round, right? Now, let's just register on Minio so I can show you inside. You can just use Google account. And now the main point of this one is that you see these ads that other people created, right? And you can see the likes, you can see the engagement, and that is by far the most important part because if there is activity on these ads, it means that people are interested in it. Once again, you can do it manually. Just head over to Facebook ads. You can see all of them. It's free, but you have to invest time and effort. Same goes with TikTok, but let's just see one of these. Let's just go on or let's just head over to the dashboard and you can see top 10 products of the day, right? And right away, you can see this one has 143K likes. People love this one. What I love about this is that you can see the website that it's been selling at and it's going to show you here. It's going to show you the ad. It's going to show you what the product is. It's something for nails. Right away, you can just use this on Pinterest as well. 
and you can see the Shopify store. You click on it, you're gonna be led to it, but as you can see, the link is broken, right? You have to search for the product. So this Shopify store is not so optimized. Let's take something else. Let's just take, let's just see what it is. So this is something for makeup as well. You can click on it, you can see the ad, you can then click on the Shopify store and it's gonna lead you there. From here, you can see what kind of website they use, what kind of structure they use. If you are into this niche, you can learn a lot. You can see what kind of creatives they use, what kind of layout they use. You can see the UGC content here. So essentially, it is the product research tool and it's not so complicated. The best thing, as I've told you, is that you can import the products from here and they will automatically appear on your Shopify store with all the details, all the descriptions, all the titles. So once you decide on what product you want to go with, well, the next thing is to find it, right? For example, you have this like mini car Apple Play, whatever it is. Yeah, it's just for some music. Now you can click on the website down there. You see that, let me just turn off this customer support. Actually, I can't. But down there, you can see the trend. You can see that it is steadily climbing here. So if you click on the website link, you'll be redirected here. So this is how I find the products that I like. I just right click on the picture and I just search by image. And then I just head over to Google or Bing or this one. And then Google Lens finds the images online. And right away, you can see I can find it on AliExpress. I can find it on YouTube. I can find it on Amazon. You know, it's just going to search by the image and you can already find it somewhere on AliExpress. And as you can see, this one, just wait for it to load. It's $11. Now you head over to the website and then you compare the price. For example, is this person is selling it for, I don't know, $20, you can just go for 15. Or if the person is selling it for, I don't know, $100, you can decide from that, right? So you will get the idea and you will get the inspiration from it. And in a nutshell, this is it. You search for products, you then find them on AliExpress and then you make your own. As you can see, this one can be perfect right? And of course, don't try to make it worldwide. Just work in your local area, right? It's going to depend where do you come from. You're just going to know what kind of price can you can put inside of your own local area. Don't try to beat the world or, I don't know, deal with Amazon or something like that because it's too saturated, right? There's a lot of people there and I think that the drop shipping thing is, you know, just for local areas. The country that you live in sticks there and you'll be all right. Once again, you will not make millions out of it, but it's a, it's still a good thing. And as you can see, I'm using a dummy account for this tutorial and I still can see the ads and I can still see some of these products, top 10 products of the day on Pinterest, on TikTok and on Facebook. And it depends what are you going to use, but just use the pictures to find these products. As you can see, this one, let's say it has 20 million views, right? For this one, you need a premium plan, which is, by the way, $50 for the lowest version of it. But hey, as I've told you, if you've got time, just do it all by yourself and save some money. Do remember, these at Minia and all the others, they just want to make money as well. But eventually, if you have many products, if you don't have enough time, the tool will serve you well. That was it for today. I'll catch you in the next one and I wish you good luck.